morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to another Monday. Hope you guys enjoyed your weekend. Uh, let me turn this off. And yeah, uh, so it's Monday. Yeah, we back with another Monday. Um, actually on my way to pick up my car. Uh, if you've seen in the previous video, when I went to Tennessee, got in an accident. So my car is ready going to pick my baby up. I've been missing it. I've been driving around in this rental. Uh, it's been cool. A little Toyota Corolla. It's all right. I mean, got a little, little touch screen in here and everything, but, uh, yeah, I want my car back because I can't even mount my phone up and do the videos how I usually be doing. Uh, so yeah, on my way to get my car, it is freezing cold outside. It's 22 degrees. I mean, I got my Jaguar Scully on. Shout out to the Jaguars, man. I know we suck right now, but you got to represent sometime for the home team. So yeah, but on my way to get my car and I'll see you guys then. Okay, so boom, I got my car back. I am super excited. Um, like I said, the rental was cool, but it's nothing like, you know what I'm saying, being in your own stuff. Like, staying at a hotel is cool, but it's nothing like sleeping in your own bed. So that's the that's the feeling I'm getting right now. Back in my car, yes, the, uh, the rental had all the bells and whistles, you know, backup camera, little sensors when you in the lane, keep you in the lane. Um, what else? Sensors on the front and back, uh, auto braking, all that. It was cool. You know what I mean? Touch screen. It was nice. It was cool, but I still like my car, my baby, Ocho. That's the, my name. That's the car, my car name, Ocho the Optimal. Um, but yeah. I don't got none of that stuff in my car. If you were wondering, no touchscreen or none of that. I still got to look back when I reverse, no camera. But that's how I like it. That's how I learned how to drive. Uh, so yeah, it's just, um, I don't know. I just like it. So that's my baby. Uh, today's conversation, I don't really have much. I, um, I wasn't able to attend therapy uh this week i had a bunch of stuff going on uh friday uh so yeah i wasn't able to attend uh, i think she sent me a message i need to probably go in there and reply to her let her know why i wasn't able to make it but i am enjoying my time as a crisis counselor it is I don't, I don't, I don't know the word. It is fulfilling. I guess that would be the word. It's very fulfilling job. Um, just helping these people out who's struggling with their mental issues, uh, mental health um, disabilities. Uh, it's very fulfilling because I mean that's why I, I started this whole mental health Monday, like just to get that. For one, to break the stigma down surrounding mental health and in the black community amongst men, just to break that stigma, but two, just to help people out. You know what I'm saying? Like people suffer in silence. So people don't want to talk about their issues. So they suffer in silence. And these people that I'm working with, like they know that they have an issue. They know they got to take their medication, but it's more than that. It's just, you know what I'm saying? Seeing them come in day one and then by day 10, you know what I'm saying? Start to see them develop habits, more positive habits, more positive outlook on life. Uh, it's just fulfilling. And I, I honestly, I, I love it for real, for real. Like it's, that's why I wanted to do social work because I knew I would be, you know what I'm saying? Doing this type of work. So I am excited. I do have work today. I work the evening shift. That's probably like the only, I'm not even going to say negative. The only thing that can get better. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Look at it in a different, different mindset. Because I work 2 to 11. So like I have the mornings off. Yeah, that's cool. But 2 o'clock to 11 o'clock at night, that's like, that's the whole day gone. So uh, once I start 
school next month um i will have to adjust my schedule so i don't know what hours i'll be working but like i said for the most part everything is going great i'm in a great mental space right now uh yeah so yeah the holidays are coming up i know this is like a a time where I, i'm not even gonna say around the world but i know specifically here in america like this is like the most positive time of the year like everybody's oh it's christmas new year like everybody is positive i always thought like why around this time everybody positive why we just can't keep that up you know what i'm saying throughout the whole year but i mean that's a different conversation for a different day but like i said i'm really happy with the job um, I have to get a physical for school, so I need to, that's one of my goals this week, to get a physical, finish submitting my paperwork, and my financial aid, and different stuff like that. But yeah, holidays, Christmas is this Saturday, then New Year's the next week after that, so it's moving. Um, 2022, I feel, will be a much better year for me personally, me, my family, um, me mentally. Just, yeah, 2021 was a tough year for me. Um, it didn't, it started in like 2020. I was facing major depression. Just, it was, it was bad. But, um, this channel has helped me a lot well i mean i, I want to say specifically the channel but yeah the channel this um i guess segment on the channel the mental health mondays have helped me out a lot just expressing myself expressing my feelings and hopefully helping others do the same in their own lives uh so yeah i will definitely continue this in 2022 be prepared it's about to get it's about to get crazy uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. A little, little short, little something, something. Got my baby back. Uh, I'm gonna I'm see if I can get some pictures of what it looked like before and then after. And I might po put that, you know what I'm saying, at the end of this. Um, my Instagram is about to get crazy. So if you're not uh, following me on Instagram, go ahead and follow me on there. Uh, every Monday I post on my story. It's a, uh, basically just a question, uh, mental health check-in. How are you feeling? And then it's like different color hearts. So you put a heart in there and then I repost it to the story and comment and basically like give you encouraging words, um, just different stuff like that. So if you're interested in that, follow me on IG. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button hit the notification so you know when i drop another video and that's it for this monday y'all um start y'all week off right you know what i'm saying like monday is the beginning of the work week so go in with a positive mindset and make it to friday uh yeah until next time remember spread love not hate peace Thank you.